Have you ever wondered why, at times, a LUT's promise to convert your footage into a cinematic color space usually comes at a cost of image quality? The answer is within the way your software deciphers the LUT. Many of you must be downloading LUTs, but when you apply it to your footage, you would have experienced banding on your footage. Not getting desired outputs is frustrating, and as a result, many people have to sacrifice their artistic expression for technical accuracy. Your video output with banding and distortions not only makes it look unprofessional, but also juvenile. In this video, we'll teach you how to appropriately apply a LUT using a better interpolation method in DaVinci Resolve to achieve smoother gradients and lesser banding. Two interpolation techniques are common in LUT processing, trilinear interpolation and tetrahedral interpolation. First of all, let's try trilinear LUT interpolation in the DaVinci Resolve. Click on the Settings icon at the bottom right corner of DaVinci Resolve. In Color Management, we'll make sure that under the Lookup section, 3D Lookup Table Interpolation is set to Trilinear. Now that we have our footage on the timeline, let's make a harsh adjustment. I'm going to select the blue color range and play around with the hue curve till it breaks our footage. Now, since the human eye might not be able to see the image breaking into bands here, we'll have to intentionally invert the colors of the image for us to see the banding in action. Although it is not necessary for you to invert image colors before applying the interpolation method, we have applied it to make you see how the math behind our software is working. Let's go ahead, disable the Invert node and create and export a 17-point LUT from this footage. Why 17-point? It's the least information LUT that DaVinci can create. This means that when we apply this LUT back, it'll be a bigger challenge for the software to recreate our adjustments accurately using just a 17-point LUT. Now, let's reset our adjustment node and copy-paste the LUT into DaVinci's LUT folder. We'll come back to the software and hit refresh inside the LUT gallery. We'll go ahead and apply the LUT on the node where our last adjustment was. We'll enable the invert node for better visibility. We'll grab a still and name it Trilinear. Hold on tight now. Now we'll apply the LUT using Tetrahedral Interpolation. Quickly reset the LUT node and disable the Invert mode. We'll head to our Color Management settings and change the interpolation method from Trilinear to Tetrahedral. Click on Update Lists, hit Save and apply the same LUT from the LUT gallery. Let's go ahead and enable the Invert node for better visibility. Notice the smooth gradient on the tetrahedral interpolation side? There is way lesser on the banding tetrahedral side. Notice how there are unpleasant color fringes on the trilinear side of the image. Tetrahedral interpolation method provides a much more pleasant hue shift. That's because it uses a superior method to interpolate values in between the data point and can perform 3D LUT interpolation with a way higher accuracy. So even with the low precision of 17-point cube LUT, you will get very superior results with tetrahedral interpolation. Talking about LUTs, our LUTs are stress-tested and made for real-world application. Colorist Factory LUTs adheres to high standards, and we don't create LUTs that promise a generic, cinematic palette, but have understood the way light works. LUTs are available depending on your footage and lighting conditions, including separate LUTs for day shots, evening shots, night shots, and shots with artificial lighting. Whether you are a color grading beginner or a seasoned colorist, Colorist Factory LUTs are tailor-made for your visual aesthetics preferences. That's it for this video. If you want to learn more about the math behind tetrahedral interpolation of LUTs, I've added a link in the description for the same. The beautiful footage we used here is for MartGrid. If you are looking for beautiful collections of story-based raw footage for your color, editing, music video or film projects, you should definitely check out ArtGrid. 
the link in the description is going to give you two months extra. If you are interested in learning more about our LUTs and secret color grading techniques, we have more videos and tutorials waiting to be released soon. So make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon. And follow us on Instagram at colorist.factory to stay updated.